comprendo. Mangiare? Yes, food, food, yeah. eating. A good, good, nice Indian food. Halal. Uh, you know, Muslim, Muslim. Musliman. Ah, yeah. Ha, ha. Halal ala buchunku. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Musliman. Yeah. Havana, yeah. Musliman. Yeah. No, no, no comprendo. No, no conocer Musliman. A Musliman area, I go eating food. Buchu. Italy, my favorite is Bangla. To me, that's how mango price is. So here, people are selling mangoes from their houses. So as you see, there's a mango there, and it's really nice. It's fresh. We're gonna buy some mangoes, and uh, all these guys. Um, Basically, they live here very local and they grow the mango in the back garden as you know and they're selling it and look at all these mangoes there is another one there I'll show you these old mangoes Oh, Bucho Tare koi na ame khoto di loi se hai amra aro kita koi Buzi na kumto kintu Buzi na kumta kintu ek bag amra mango loi se pura ek boro bag Kunto koi na kumta Aar ee bag amare se lagge Three cook One, two, three Two cook Two cook a uh, two cooker in the doil now, egg pound. Egg pound, take egg bag. Are you going to be another house? Do I need to translate that? Yeah. Okay, I'll do it. Guys, viewers watching, we basically bought a bag full of mangoes from that little girl there. And we paid basically two cooks for a full bag of mangoes we're going to eat in the Casa. As you know, Casa is the public estate. And uh, we basically gave it a few more quid. So, Two cookies around one pound, and we, I think we gave it about five yeah. cook. That's Jeff got nearly five kilo, I tell you. Yeah. Five times six. Uh, five times six. My math is really bad because I went to Walthy of School. About 30 pounds. About 30 quid, yeah. And uh, working tour to the tobacco and coffee plantation. So when you come, ask one for Wilfredo. Wilfredo is the man. So do 
look for this guy in Vinale. So guys, what a day it's been. And uh, we met some awesome people here. We are in uh, Vinale. It's basically about three hours away from uh, Cuba, Havana. And this place is amazing, awesome. It's our first time here. And from my first time experience, it's a beautiful place. This resort, got a nice hotel, got a nice swimming pool, and the view is amazing. If you look behind the view, all these hills and mountains, the beautiful, awesome backdrop. And um, I would recommend whenever you go to Cuba or wherever, do try all different places. Because just a little bit away from uh, Vinales, so all the rural areas, you've seen so much. Uh, plantations of bananas, of mangoes and all sorts of different things and this is amazing so let me show you a little tour of Vinale. Keep on watching. Oh, excellent. excellent. Um, so most of the things I can see there, you've got like some uh, designs of faces, sculptures. Okay, so they've got some nice, nice wood and they're all wood as well. Okay, so it's actually made from the palm tree. So guys, it's actually made from palm tree. And this is an awesome shop. So whenever you come to Vinale, they've got all sorts of stuff and they've got cigars as well. So do shop around. And um, where are all these place things I just made? Are they made in Vinale or? In Vinale, in all our products. Okay. Tell me three good things about Vinale. Okay, thank you, it's been a pleasure and I'll just show a little bit of this one. Okay, thank you, it's been a pleasure. Thanks. We've had a small little issue, but it happens. I've smashed my phone screen all of it. Spain. Spain. Alright. Yes, Hello. Spain. Hola. We needed Rachel here. Yeah, I know. Rachel. Rachel. Hall tour. Yeah, yeah. Hall. Kaiba, Kaiba Hall. Yeah, not these. But I don't like hosts. You know, I sit down. With wheels. Okay. Yeah. Oh, that's it. Yeah. Man. With wheels. Coche de caballo. Lost in uh, translation, guys. Basically, we come in Vinale, and uh, we asked these guys specifically. We wanted a proper horse and carriage to take it because I don't like just riding horses but what they've done is they've got all these big monstrous horses for us to ride but I'm not too happy about that so let's see if they change it to a horse carriage it had this air Mozart Amor Sack New Ilone these plants are the aloe vera plants and all that stuff because inside there really soft, white, more apparent stuff in it, which they use to make shampoo and all other sorts of other cosmetics in. So guys, we are on the um, horse carriage. We had a bit of an issue. Originally we told we want a horse carriage, but because of the language barrier, the language uh, problem we have lost in communication or lost in translation, they got us a few horses, but I'm not too happy about riding a horse rider because, you know, very uncomfortable riding a horse. You might fall off, injuries, etc. So then we waited about half an hour. So we've got our horse carriage now. So we're going to explore a bit of an alley. Coconut is so good and so healthy for you. So 
Let me enjoy my coconut. Let's see how it is. Mm. Coconut is beautiful, awesome. Guys, definitely try a coconut. Hey, beautiful people around the world. Guess where we are? Cuba, Havana, and it's actually not Havana, sorry. This place is Vinales. How do you guys normally say? Because it was from uh, UK, we say Vinales. How do you say Vinales? Vinales. And what about Havana? We would say Havana, or how do you say Havana? Havana. That's not how he normally says it. Anyway, guys, um, I guess you're from, not from around here. Okay, where are you guys from? New York. Oh, New York, the city. I've always wanted to do America and I will do it, inshallah, one day. I don't know when, but we are actually going to go to Canada in the next week or so. So, how's it been? Like here, what have you been doing? It's been really awesome. Uh, we've done a little bit of horseback riding, we've just sort of some nice rides from the valley, we're going to check out some cases. How are you on the horse? Because I'm quite scared of horses. So, <laughs> <laughs> so, we've got one of the horse carriages. And the horses are pretty calm. Okay. Uh, so, it was a nice little ride. Did you try to be a cowboy? Yeehaw! Yeah, yeah! <laughs> no, 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 no. You tried to be like a Muslim East one. Good, bad, ugly, like that. <laughs> okay, so tell us about your stay then. How you been finding the stay here? You find it safe? Yeah, things are so good. Going to you. <laughs> <laughs> How you been finding it with the uh, price one? Is it quite expensive? Would you say very reasonable or cheap? We've got a bit of dilemma. Yep. It's not been recorded. Uh. <laughs> just kidding, just kidding. <laughs> the best way to relax and chill is to have a refreshing coke drink. Last time I had one of these coconut drinks was in uh, Thailand. And I think that was last year. This is an amazing drink, and the best thing is after you finish, chop it in the heart and have the inside. It's really fresh. Let's see how this is. It's a little bit warm because it's a really hot egg, but it's still drinkable and it's